Hello everybody, it's Christopher here. I just want to do a quick video on uh, what I've been up to this morning. Uh, I'm working on making asphalt cracks, or uh, cracks in the asphalt and, uh, and patches. Uh, right now I'm working in the small parking lot. That's gonna be for the convenience store. Um, I go on Google Earth and I really uh, 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 suggest everybody do the same if you really want to show, do details on what are, what things really look like. Google Earth is the best. You can really see how roads look, you know, details on, on uh, wherever, you know, anywhere where you can travel on the road, basically you can go on Google Earth Street View. Anyway, so I, I use to make my um, asphalt uh, 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 cracks. I use a sh fine Sharpie and rarely do I use my microns. Usually I use this for something else. But I want to get a little bit of detail in here. And uh, yeah. Uh, stuff I use for my roads is I use basically drywall compound. And, uh, it, you know, some people use smooth it, plaster of Paris, but I always like this better. I don't know what it is, but, you know. So, um, it, this stuff itself, when it dries, will create potholes for you and, and whatnot. And if you don't want potholes, you can, once it dries, you can go over it one more time with a, a really watery um, uh, amount and fill in the holes or whatever. Then you, when it dries, you sand it down or whatnot. But um, I'm modeling a place where, you know, roads don't necessarily get, you know, they're rough. So, so anyway, we've reached 100 and five lights. So it's time for the uh, drawing for the eight by 10 painting. You got 14 people who have uh, decided to partake in the drawing. The drawing will be held at nine o'clock tomorrow evening. It's nine o'clock, nine o'clock Eastern on Tuesday evening. Um, I will be doing that live and uh, I will have my brother be the one who selects the uh, lucky person's name out of the uh, item or whatever. I don't know if I'll use a hat or or something, you know. But you still have time. If you went in for the drawing for the 8x10 painting of whatever you want, just comment below you want in. Those who already have, I got your names down. I had a list down. I was going to I was gonna name them off, but I forgot I left it over by my desk. So anyway, so anyway, I'm uh, rambling on here and uh, I'll let you go. Hopefully later on this evening, I'll be able to finish doing the uh, cleaning up the lines and getting all the uh, pots, pot, what's it pot holes finished and everything cleaned up and uh yeah and all that so oh by the way i've been uh doodling messing around with tinkercad and i've been making modern concrete power lines and i got the um got them almost done gonna make them out of resin i got a resin printer so i'm gonna make a whole bunch and uh i'm actually gonna start selling them as well same as the um uh modern traffic lights uh we have a design but what we tried to print it out me we meaning my brother and i try to print them out on his abs 3d printer and it just couldn't hung, handle the um uh details that we put into it so the resin can handle details a lot better so we're going to be printing up modern traffic signals and modern uh, uh, concrete telephone poles. 
and once I put them together and uh, yeah they should look really good on here and like I can say well we'll have a link once we get them done and we, we work out the kinks I'll have a link where you can go buy some so anyway all right well that's about it I just want to say happy model railroading peace out